welcome you cancers this is the first week of um october i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back please remember to like share and subscribe subscribe ladies and gentlemen and share these videos i want to say to each and every person um thank you so much for your like shares and and please subscribe um this week is the week of the wheel of fortune it's sophia week so um, the Wheel of Fortune always uh, help people to have their wishes and dreams. Okay, so uh, energy popped out, but we're going further. So the week is beginning from the 30th of September until the 9th, the 30th of September until um, the 6th of October. And I want to say to each person, thank you so much. Please check out the monthly readings. Go check out the on demand because there's a lot of um, information. For every three on demand, 15% off. For every three on demand, 15% off. And I'm doing this because um, um, I want everyone to have extra information to deal with this coming period, especially in this week. This whole week is going to be a week where you're dealing with a lot of stuff. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, this is a steer mark or this is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person fell out. Okay, they need to pay you some money. Whoever this person is need to pay you some money or money is going to be coming in. All right. So whatever has happened, whatever has transpired, um, whoever this person is and however it affects you, Cancers. So we're calling up on the angels, the Cancers to come in, the pure light beams, the universal angels and guide, the goddesses and the goddess masters and ascendants masters. This is for the Cancers, the Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Okay, there's a message coming out and the message is saying that you need to stand your ground. Whatever is happening, you need to stand your ground. So we are going back, stand your ground against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. Um, and for some of you, it is um, reaching your goals. Okay, so <laughs> the cards, if you see, ladies and gentlemen, they're just popping out. So some of you could be connecting with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. I'm seeing love coming in for you guys. Um, this person came up and obviously there is love that is coming in from this person. I'm seeing them not only offering you financial stability, but also love. So whoever this person is, they're understanding what is going on. Then we have the energy of the magician. If your question was, should I go with the, this person? Should I take the offer from this person? It is a yes. Okay. So if your question was, should I take the offer from this person? It is a yes. Okay. So um, whatever is transpiring and happening, and some of you want to know if you should take the offer from this person, it is a yes. So some of you have met someone and this person is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. Um, and you want to know whether or not you should get involved with this person. It is a yes. Um, again, the energy of the seven of pentacles is here. Um, whatever that was happening with, uh, um, you know, if this is an offer of work from this person, it is a yes. Okay. We have the Queen of Swords that is coming up. Whoever this Queen of Swords is that is coming up and whatever that is transpiring, I'm seeing um, that whoever this person is, this person is coming up and cutting through whatever has transpired. Okay. The truth is coming out. The truth is definitely coming out. So whatever is coming out, I'm seeing an investigation taking place. Whatever that has transpired, I'm definitely seeing an investigation taking place. And uh, I'm seeing that some of you need to stand your grounds, okay? Um, and when I say stand your grounds, it could be with a partner. Definitely an investigation is coming up. Um, there is uh, um, the Queen of Swords, uh, and the 
um, page of sorts. Now, whenever this little fella comes up, some investigation is taking place and it has to do with and looking at something that has transpired. So, you know, again, we're seeing deceptiveness that deceptiveness, whatever deceptiveness has happened and it has to do with the Knight of Pentacles, whoever this Knight of Pentacles is. Um, this is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius between the age of 18 and 45. It could be for some of you, your partners, but whatever is happening with this Knight of Pentacles, there is, a, there is an investigation coming in um, at this person, whatever this person has done. There is an investigation. Number seven is going to be um seven you're on the right part whatever is transpiring and happening i'm seeing secrets are coming out secrets are coming out okay so the queen the queen of pentacles the, the queen of pentacles is here whoever this queen of pentacles is she is cutting through and showing up the truth about something she's cutting through and showing up the truth about something this woman is using the swords as an Aries Leo or Sagittarius these two women could find out something you're going to be overcoming an issue whoever is dealing with an issue with an um a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn you're overcoming this issue you you are going to be hitting the jackpot with this because you were right on track um so some of you were dealing with a young person between the age of 18 and 45 you're overcoming it it could be a situation where um it's a car dealer um it, it has something to do vacation you booked a vacation this person tried to deceive you of what and now it's as if you sued them and went to court and you're eating the jackpot new love is coming in whatever is transpiring new love is coming in i'm seeing people are going to be opening up and offering love new love is coming in and some of you it could be new love with this um taurus virgo or capricorn person definitely oh la la oh la la wow okay <laughs> okay cancers all right, someone, definitely a new baby is going to be coming in, but um, marriage, love, you are going to be meeting the love of your life, Cancers. It does. <laughs> oh my God, success is coming in, Cancers. Your financial stability is definitely going to be good. Um, whatever you're doing, whatever you're working on, it's definitely going to be good there's an organization that is coming in and trying to figure out what has transpired some of you are going to be having some regrets because the investigation is coming out because um, whoever that were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and try to um, and try to decept her she's going to be showing you up an investigation is coming in for some of you cancers and um this lady is cutting away and finding out the truth about an issue especially the truth about a house because they're going to be finding out yeah they're going to be finding out what exactly has transpired okay so some of you be aware if you have done something to disperse it, it's coming out and you have to find inner strength because they're going to be realizing what you have done. You're going to be trying. Some of you have been um, working with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. Now, it can be a Sagittarius. The truth is going to be coming out about this person. The truth is going to be coming out about this person. So, whatever there was that um you guys whether you are in a relationship um whether you were in a relationship or you are married to this person the truth is going to be coming out because i'm seeing that you're trying to find inner strength now some of you men could have been cheating on your wife that is an aries leo or sagittarius um and what is happening is that it could be coming out here it is that whatever information because this this person 
she is taking down situation organization she is she is breaking down a lot of stuff um whatever is transpiring she's really taking down a lot of stuff because she's cutting through she has investigated a lot of things and she's showing the truth of what has been transpiring she's showing up the truth of what is transpiring so for some of you it's going to be good for some of you this person whoever this person is is an highly intelligent lady this lady working an organization this is going to be a, a new start for this lady but whoever has deceptively done something and work with the knight and and uh, a young person between the age of 18 and 45 okay we got it ladies and gentlemen this week is wheel of fortune A lot of good things is coming out for you, Cancer. Okay. When it comes on to love, loving this week, Cancer, is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I'm seeing situation with family. There needs to be more communication. Communications with the family. There need to be more communications with the family. Whoever decide to go in a relationship with a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, this is between the age of 15, 18, and 45, this is a marriage that was made to be, okay? This is beautiful. If you plan to buy a car, yes, you're going to be um, winning big. Yes, go for it. Some of you, um, you you or if you're planning a marriage this marriage is going to be wonderful you're going to be having the financial stability um for this marriage whatever is happening here with the organization and some situation that is affecting you cancers there is going to be some regret so watch your money you cancers in this week make sure that your money is there because whatever is happening some deceptiveness is going on some deceptiveness is going on so watch your money watch your money you can sirs watch the bank your bank account you can sis in this week this is coming up because you're going to be pissed when you find out something someone have been skimming from your bank account you can sirs but um um it's like um this woman this 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 taurus virgo capricorn woman she is using the sword of truth and cutting through. Some of you who had an outside relationship with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, um, your wife is or your wife is going to be finding out about this. So if you men was having an outside affair, your wife is definitely going to be finding out about this. Okay, definitely. There is marriage made. So a lot of you are going to be connecting with your twin flame and soulmate. Wheel of Fortune, yes, this was the person. So if some of you decide to get in a relationship with someone and the person asks you to marry them or move in with them, it's a yes. Go ahead. Whatever questions that I didn't answer, it's a yes. Definitely there's an investigation that is going to be happening with the lovers. So um, there could be a new love that some of you, but it's as if you're married. So whatever is transpiring, there is a marriage made in heaven, but um, this is good. Go for it. Um, buy the lottery. Um, listen, it's a week for you cancers to listen. Whatever is happening in this week, listen. And it says, quiet your mind, beloved one, and listen to our gentle um, reassurance that everything has been taken care of stay in quiet and receptive state without worrying about exactly the nature of your desired manifest manifestation a quiet mind and body hear us quickly and clearly this is our request to you listen 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 okay so it's a week of listening for you guys i want to say thank you and namaste